This is me, Sabina, on my first ever international cruise, and here is how that went. T minus about five seconds. Go, go, go. Look at it. Discovery Princess. Yes, we're on board. First impression's pretty good. Oh my god, it's gorgeous. It's beautiful, and it smells spanning here. Oh, there are loads of shops, art galleries. Should we go to the room? We've taken the elevator up to our floor, and here are all the pools. There's a little poolside cafe. <gasps> okay, we are inside. Look at that balcony. Oh my gosh. Look how big this terrace is. And now I'm gonna flip it. Look at all this. That's where I'm gonna have my Titanic moment. Okay, this is shaping up to be a very, very nice trip. Ruta Morgan, Ayo Gusaymas, Chindobre. Dzień dobry, that's Polish. Polish, yes. Okay. Dobry wietro. And bon dia. You're yeah. much better at languages than I am, and I literally make videos about language learning. Oh, very good. Bye. 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 Here's what's going to happen next. We are going to order some food. Click. Guacamole. Sounds delicious. A salad? Which one do we want? Which one do we want? If I'm coming across a little crazy today, it's because I'm very jet lagged. We just flew in yesterday. It's an 11 hour flight. Um, yeah, it just takes a bit out of you with the jet lag. There's an eight hour difference between LA and London. Um, but also partly I attribute it to the fact that I'm incredibly excited. Excuse me, we've just had a delivery and this is actually bonkers. We've got a garden salad with ranch dressing, guac, we've got a fruit platter. Let me carry it over here just so you can briefly admire the view again. <laughs> Sorry, I'm struggling to position the camera and I want to be in shot so we're going to eat like this. Okay, this is getting out of hand. Our friend Javier just stopped by again to bring me a glass of champagne. I'm having a bit of a moment, like, do you know? You know, sometimes you just think to yourself, like, why me? Like, you get to this place in your head. I don't want to get too deep, but I have had one and a half sips of champagne, so get ready. Um, no, but you just feel undeserving. You think, this is way too nice for me to be staying here. You know, like someone, someone more important should be here. Someone who deserves it more. And look, there. There are people who probably do more incredible things for humanity than making videos about their travels, but equally, this is something I would say to anyone that isn't me, and that is that you do deserve a break and you do deserve to treat yourself. Um, but, it's, but it's harder to accept it for you. I always feel like I'm not doing enough or yeah, I'm just undeserving for whatever reason. So I'm gonna use this trip to try and change that narrative. Oh, <laughs> get through here. Change that narrative in my head and I don't know, try to be a bit more relaxed and try to feel a bit more deserving of all the stuff, which, which is difficult because this is insane. We're ready to go. Here's my dress. Our magnificent ship is longer than the Eiffel Tower is tall, and our width is uh, similar to the height of the Statue of Liberty. Thank you so much. <laughs> to show you around the ship. It's not gonna be possible today. Tomorrow, friends, stay cheers. Thank you, have Welcome. a good day. Bye, bye bye. Look at all this. And done. Thank you, bye. bye. I was gonna eat outside, but um, it is incredibly windy. It's so windy I could barely open the um, door. Do I mind this setup? Not at all. There is even a bottle of champagne, which I don't know, it's 9 a.m. It was very nice. They've even brought capers. I know they're a bit controversial, not everyone likes them. I love them. Very excited about this. Well, hello there. I have gotten dressed. I'm gonna go hit the pool. There's some jacuzzis on board. We're gonna, we're gonna play it by ear. By the way, I wanted to mention this lanyard around my neck. This is the medallion and this unlocks all like your doors you check in with it on board you pay with it they do have other accessories that you can buy on board they have these sustainably produced bracelets and clips now let's go thank you so much <laughs> thanks cheers <laughs> cheers ah oh. i have a spa appointment right now guess we got fancy water
we are at breakfast and the breakfast here are insane because there's just a giant buffet. It starts here with some poached fruits and like mostly ingredients. And then we're approaching like the cooked section. Dominica, what are your thoughts on the buffet? It's amazing. I'm so hungry. Let's get everything. <laughs> I'm really hungry as well. They're, they have so many different types of food yeah. and like all the different diets are accounted for. It's, it's really cool. It's really busy. I should, I should probably not be vlogging right now. That thing right here is literally steak. Not allowed to eat my food. Sorry, huh? I have just caught my first ever glimpse of Mexico. We're here. on the little boat that's going to take us to mainland Mexico from our ship. Um, the views are already looking very nice. Look! We just boarded the bus and we're about to go to Salsa and Salsa! You are to going to learn how to make salsas and how to dance salsas and practice your dance. Our salsa class was held at a swanky local hotel, the Playa Grande Resort. What I hadn't fully realized or mentally prepared for was the imbibing side of things. Basically, it was all you can drink margaritas. We even made our own. We squeezed in half a lime, a large shot of tequila, and about half that amount of triple sec, like Cointreau. The result was good, but very strong. Then we had frozen strawberry margarita shots. These were delicious. And then it was time to salsa. I don't know yet. Yeah, it's not as spicy. Try ours. Yeah. Okay, look, the rest of the class, understandably, was a bit of a blur. We did lots of dancing, but I'll be kind to everyone and keep the clips very brief. It was really fun. And to top it off, we actually saw a whale doing backflips on the beach, which was uh, pretty cool. And then we took this little golf cart to a uh, tequila tasting. No comment. ¿Cómo se llama? Jesús. Sabina. Mucho gusto. ¿De dónde vienes? Uh, the Czech Republic of Czech. Oh, wow. These are plants. That's the blue agave. Okay, the whole name, whole name is blue agave Weber. Weber was a German guy who selected the plants long time ago. Arriba! Arriba! everywhere. Um, I'm not even sure I'm going to be able to use any of these videos because, not going to lie, I am a bit of a lightweight. I'm just going to casually lean against a wall and have, have a little nap. Hi, welcome back to Girl vs Globe. I hope you're all doing well. Remember to like, subscribe, make sure you ring that bell because I don't know if you know but only 40% of our viewers are actually subscribed to the channel. I could never do it that well. And then it was time to explore Cabo. Look, this place is what it is. If you want an authentic Mexican experience, this ain't it. But if you want to have a fun, boozy holiday abroad, get a tan, switch off your brain for a little while, and maybe occasionally practice your Spanish, Cabo is good for that. With that in mind, here's probably my favorite local discovery, Rooftop 360. It's currently the highest terrace in town, throw in an infinity pool, and you've got the perfect location for a bougie night out. This is 360. Cheers everyone, thank you Cheers. for putting up with us. That over there is our ship. Can you see it? It's not so bad. Oh, this is insane. Look at this. This place has been a real incredible discovery. I would thoroughly recommend it. It's gorgeous. Look at that. Wow. Looks really pretty at night. <laughs> this video makes me look like such an alcoholic. And I like literally rarely drink, but an all-inclusive holiday is just one of those times where you let yourself go. <laughs> Seals are still there. Okay, we're about to take our masks off. Meta! I wanted to show you the view. 
Cafe of Cabo from my stateroom. So I woke up bright and early at 7 today and that is because I'm going snorkeling on a private ship. Oh! That's my yeah. crew. Thank you so the ladies. Hi. 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 Hello! Hi. Good morning! Hi! That's a lot of energy. <laughs> Better drink up. <laughs> Away. Excuse me, I'm big. Arr! Arr! Hey, we have a lot of crazy pirates today. Alright, the pirate ship has moored and we're about to go in. <laughs> Forced to wear these vests. I mean, the, the best to be safe, but stylish, what do we think? It's a no, isn't it? Yeah, it's a no. So this is our final, final day here in Cabo and in Mexico all together. Um, we literally have about 15 minutes left before we absolutely have to get on the ship. But I'm just trying to get my Mexico time in because I've never been here. Hello. <laughs> Tonight is formal night, so I'm trying to change my makeup from day to night. Oh, which I mean I'm adding eyeliner. That's literally it. Okay, we're ready to go. I'm going to put my heels on, which means my face is no longer going to be in shop. That is correct. <laughs> it tastes like Thanksgiving. <laughs> Well, the time has come for me to pack literally all of this stuff up. I've made, I've made a mess. I haven't, I haven't. I. Um, but before I do that, I want to show you. I want to prove to you that we're back in LA. Do you remember this view? And just like that, it is over. I have just disembarked from the ship. Oh, sorry, and crashed into this column. Um, I am continuing my trip here in California. I'm staying in LA. So if you'd like to see more of the area, then stay tuned. I'm going to be doing an entire separate vlog on it. Otherwise, thank you so much for watching hit that subscribe button as, as the cool YouTubers say um, and I'll see you next Friday. Bye!